I'm Lucy Reynolds, and I am a one-year survivor of breast cancer. I had my routine mammogram in November 2016. They called me back and said, oh, it's probably nothing. We call lots of people back. And the next week I had a follow-up mammogram and then an ultrasound. And then the, ultra, the uh, radiologist himself came out and continued the ultrasound. And when he patted me on the leg and said, we just need to do a biopsy. And I kind of knew in my spirit that this was not good news. But it was December the 9th, 2016, when I got a call from my surgeon to say, there's a little bit of cancer in there, she said. <laughs> and it was like it was coming from a tunnel. All of a sudden, I could hardly hear what she was saying. I just felt numb and I can't believe this is happening to me. I had a lumpectomy in January of 2017, and I had what is called the Canadian Protocol of Radiation, where instead of having radiation for six weeks, five days a week, they do a higher dose of radiation for four weeks. And I have since learned that that results in a higher incidence of lymphedema. I mainly associated lymphedema with the removal of lymph nodes in the armpit and, and women who had struggled with lymphedema in their arms. And that's what I had anticipated. I did not anticipate, and I don't think the oncologist or the surgeon anticipated that I would develop lymphedema also in my breast as a result of the uh, radiation. To me, that was more depressing than having lymphedema in my arm. <laughs> There's a grieving process involved there. Your body's not what it used to be. You're glad to be alive, <laughs> healthy, but yet you just wish that things could be like they used to be.